Hey, this is Brian Jones from Valhalla Academy in Frankfort, Kentucky, and this is part of our Fundamental Movement Skills series. Today we're going to be working on the side fall. The side fall and the back fall share some common characteristics. Uh, first of all, we want to make sure that our chin is tucked so that our head does not impact the mat. Okay? We are going to smack the mat with one arm, with the other arm up on the side of our chest. So this way, by smacking the mat, we end up impacting with our side rather than our arm first, okay? Um, if we reach for the mat as we're falling, we, take it, we stand at risk of injuring either our wrist, our elbow, or our shoulder. So we want to make sure that we're not grabbing at the ground with our hand or driving our elbow into the mat. The third thing is we want to make sure we exhale so that we don't get the wind knocked out of us. Okay, so take, inhaling as you land can uh, lead to getting the wind knocked out of you, which is very uncomfortable. And in a tournament situation or in a street fight, can make the difference in your opponent getting the advantage. So, what we're going to do is start from the ground up. Um, and I'm going to show you the position that I want you to be in for the side fall. So, we're going to work from here. Notice that this foot is up. This foot is out, and my hand is up, this one is on the ground. My head is off the mat, okay? So when we do this, the first part of it, we're just going to do it from a seated position. We're going to land here and then sit back up. So when we can do this from a seated position, I'll extend my leg and then rock back. Notice that I'm allowing my um, legs to kind of come up a little bit. I want you to be used to, if you land, uh, getting into a position of where you can actually play guard. So if you've got, taken a fall, you've gotten thrown, your opponent takes you down, uh, you can actually fight from there as opposed to just leaving your legs down. The reason I'm showing this is I want your right leg on the right side and your left leg on the left side. All, all too often, you see people fall and cross their legs over like this. Okay, that's really wrong for uh, several reasons. So one, one of them, if you're a man, uh, you're gonna hurt your testicles. Okay, I've seen it happen. It doesn't feel very good. So I don't want to cross my legs over. I want to make sure that this leg stays here and this leg stays here. Okay. So. What we're going to do now is move up to the squat position like we did in the back fall. So it's the second part of the progression. All right, so we start from a seated position, we move to a squat position. This takes a little bit more coordination because we're not going straight back. What I'm going to do from here is to straighten my leg and then I'm going to fall back. Okay, I'll do a few reps. I'll do a few reps from the other side. Okay, so that is the lying down to seated progression. Now we're going to move from a standing position. And there's very little difference in uh, what we did in the standing position with the back fall and what we're going to do with the side fall. We're not jumping initially, we're squatting down into the positions. We're sort of sitting down on our leg or on our heel. Um, and we're going to rock back just like we did. Again, make sure the students know how to stand in base. If they don't, click the, if you haven't seen this video, make sure that you watch the video of stand in base. Um, so that they're practicing getting up properly after every rep. So I'm going to step forward with one leg and I'm going to swing my rear arm and my rear leg as if they're attached 
so that I'm sliding it out and stepping up, okay? So they're gonna kind of follow each other like this. You can think of tapping your leg and knocking it up there. The next thing I'm gonna do is sit my butt down close to my heel on this side and finish the fall. So here's the entire motion. Okay, and again, stepping forward, I'll do this side this time. Swing the leg up. Just like that. Okay, from the side. Step forward. So that is our side fall progression. This has been Brian Jones from Valhalla Academy, Frankfort, Kentucky, reminding you to train hard, train smart, and train off. We'll see you next time.